and I feel so good And it looks so unreal It looks like a dream Cause I found a lot of Oh, a lot of friends And we have a good time I think this is great Whoa. An odyssey of the mind Give a lot for us Odyssey of the mind Gave a lot for us Hello, everybody. Oh, man, that's so good to hear. My name is Will Miklas, and welcome to the 2021 Odyssey of the Mind World Finals. Uh, it's so good to see all of you here, hearing all this noise, having you all in person. It's been a long year. It's been a long it's been a rough process getting here, but we did it with some creative problem solving, a lot of help from the state of Florida, and all of you too. So thank you very much.
Now, I know you're not all here to see me, because we're all really here to see the most creative raccoon on the planet. We got Omer over here. All right, so now I'm gonna go around, and we only have, we only were able to do teams from the United States to be here. So I'm gonna introduce each of the associations and their association director. So when you hear your state called, stand, be recognized, everybody else give them a round of applause. Okay. All right, so we have Arizona and their AD, Deanna Day. Next, we have Arkansas with their AD, Emily Hill. I'd like to give a round of applause for Northern California and their AD, Deidre Gerard. We have Southern California and their AD, Lynn Larson. Colorado and their AD, Calipot. Let's give a round of applause for Connecticut and their AD, Mimi Owen. We also have Delaware and their AD, Jackie Blevins. I know this is gonna get some applause. We have Florida and their AD, Matt Whaley. Not too far from Florida, we have Georgia and their AD, Lisa Hackney. Next up is Indiana and their AD, Jacob Mitchell. We also have Iowa here with their AD, Alan Strohmeyer. We also have Kentucky and their AD, Dalen Jensen. Shout out to our friends up north in Michigan with their AD, Pam Gombert. Next up is Missouri and their AD, Jerlyn Jones. Next is the great state of New Jersey and their AD, Nicholas Pankowitz. New York is next up with their AD, Lynn Lucas. We also have Oklahoma and their AD, Marianne Zamore. Next up is Pennsylvania and their AD, Jerry Owens. We also have our friends from Tennessee and their AD, Alan Ball. Make some noise for our friends in Texas and their AD, Steve Rice. And last but certainly not least, Virginia and their AD, David Suda. So, we were only able to have teams from the United States, as uh, previously mentioned, but we don't want to leave our friends and their international teams out. So I'd like to just 
announced the international teams that competed this year that weren't able to make it here and their ADs as well. So just make some noise for them. We got some nice uh, graphics for them too. I forgot North Carolina. <laughs> Nobody gave it to me. All right, all right, yeah, so North Carolina is also here. <laughs> Sorry, North Carolina. <laughs> but yeah, so our international ADs and uh, international teams. So our first international administration is Belarus and their AD, Marina Bardien. <laughs> Next up is Canada and their AD, Cheryl Atwater. Our friends over in China and their AD, Wei Xin Chen. Not too far from there, we have Hong Kong and their AD, Kwak Leung Lao. Because of India and their AD, Previt Saktava. Our friends over in Japan and their AD, Miki Matsubara. And not too far from us here right now in Mexico and their AD, Monica Garza. We also have our friends over in Poland and their AD, Wojtek Radzinovic. We also have Russia and their AD, Larissa Matviva. So our Northwest Russia and their AD, Natalie Skortskova. And, uh, and we also have Singapore and their AD, Erin Ko. So give a round of applause for Slovakia and their AD, Eric Ortenobach. Also South Korea and their AD, Royce Young Hyun Bak. And last up for our internationals and certainly not least, it's Switzerland and their AD, Marcia Banks. All right, so everybody, yeah, everybody stay seated and we're gonna get on with the celebrations. And to start off, I'd like to introduce my father and program director of Odyssey of the Mind, Mr. Sammy Miklas. Thank you, Will. It's really important that he announced those names of those international associations and directors because they all participated in the virtual Odyssey the Mind World Finals. And there are teams here who participated in the virtual Odyssey the Mind World Finals. Please stand up and be recognized for participating in both. Thank you. The other part about announcing all those nations is when you're in the 2022 World Finals next year, at another site, you'll be competing and meeting people from those countries. Now, having two World Finals is really difficult, and it's only made possible by our thousands and thousands of volunteers. At the top of that list of volunteers, our international problem captains who oversaw almost 900 virtual Odyssey the Mind teams, and here there's gonna be over 230 in-person Odyssey the Mind teams. So let me introduce to you to our international problem captains, beginning with problem one, Omer the Romer, international problem captain, Mr. Wayne Odie.
Now we move on to problem two, and who knew the name of this problem was going to be so apropos even a year later? <laughs> Virtual Odyssey with international problem captain, Mrs. Carol Byros. <laughs> now we move over to problem three, Omer and the Beanstalk with international problem captain, Mr. Matt Lopez. Matt, when you started, you didn't have any gray hair. <laughs> Problem four, he just said I match now, just in case you didn't hear. Problem four, and this explains the last 16 months of all of our lives, it's a trap with international problem captain, Mr. Walter Barletta. Oh, problem five. We're so happy, but so sad. <laughs> problem five, superhero socks, a cliffhanger beginning. That's the happy part. The sad part is, this is the last time I will ever be saying this, except for our award ceremony. International problem captain, Charlene Smith. Now, they're the problem captains, and they're the ones you see in their judging teams. But there are two problem captains that most teams never see, and they're the ones you really want to see. You want to bring them baked goods and stuff like that, because every team is impacted by them. First, in our spontaneous competition with international problem captain Joy Kurtz. And now the real one, the one who hides away. You might see him running back and forth from room to room, gathering scores. Our international scoring problem captain, Mr. Jeff Carter. <laughs> okay, every year we identify one very worthy and outstanding volunteer who has going above and beyond. Because all these people and your coaches and, and you have gone above and beyond, but some do it to a different level. And we call this award our Odyssey the Mind Spirit Award. Beginning 17 years ago, Anna Long began coaching her daughter's team. <laughs> she coached, became an assistant regional director, while coaching for a couple years, and then became and maintains the position of regional director of one of our best growing regions in the world. She volunteers at World Finals as an international host, and I could go on about she's presented on marketing to our different associations, and she volunteers in every which way there is. Her employer, Dean Mead, who let's give a shout out to them, gave her all the time and all the resources needed to make this event happen. Literally, without Anna Long, we would not be sitting here today. So I announced the, International, the Odyssey of Mind Spirit Award goes to Anna Long. Other Spirit Award winners, please stand up. My daughter said, don't embarrass me, but she's not here. <clears throat> so I'll make this quick because I was dared to do it. Everybody stand. And repeat after me. <clears throat> I've got spirit, yes I do. I've got spirit, how about? Thank you, Anna. Now, one of the reasons why Anna was so successful is because of Orange County. Orange County Mayor Jerry L. Demings, his offices and services 
made so many special arrangements to make this possible. Mr. The mayor could not be here today, but we really thank him and his representative, Andrea Willis, is here to accept our first outstanding UM reward of 2021. <laughs> World Finals. Good morning, rock stars. And by the way, not only does Mayor say welcome and congratulations for all your amazing work during this indeed virtual odyssey, he also has a nice hello. He misses his buddy Omer, so he said hi. So I serve Mayor Demings as the Chief Innovation and Emerging Technology Officer, the first for our county. And I'm really excited to be here with you all today. I'm very passionate about innovation work, obviously. It's it's in my DNA, and it's in your DNA. And I want you to know that more of these C-level jobs of innovating, building it with an empathy um, stakeholder, we call them empathy safaris and some of the work that we use. We use design thinking. We're building an innovation lab here at the county. There will be one someday here at the convention center. So as you come back, and I'm working hard on making sure we can get Odyssey and Mind World Finals to come back here more often than just this year. Yep because we've got to get you into our innovation tapestry here. We've got a lot of cool opportunities for you as you get older and go through high school and eventually college. We want you to come back to Orange County and consider doing some innovation work here. So first things first, I'm really excited to hear there are 20 states. So by the count of three, I want you to shout out what state you're from so I can tell Mayor Demings who's here today, okay? One, two, three. Oh, he's going to be thrilled that there's 20 states of people here. We've missed people visiting us, right? And then I have another question, because I've got a cool factoid for the last group. But I want to see, let's start. We're going to skip around a bit. Who's working on the humor car project? I'm calling it the humor car. Let me see. All right. We've got some brilliant minds of the future for the automotive uh, industry. And I really do want self-driving cars that drive you to very humorous places, so I need you to work on that for the future. Okay, by a show of hands, who's working on those fabulous Beanstalk-inspired uh, bacon soda projects? Okay. I see those steam creative souls coming through. We've got a lot of cool entertainment needs down here. And then who's working on the superhero socks? That's pretty amazing. I'm sure you're aware that we have quite a few Marvel friends down here, so we definitely need some innovative socks and maybe some other undergarments for them. <laughs> and then who's working on the most delicate but deadly trap? I like that you're using some wild materials for some new uses, so I think you could probably help in sustainability or some other really neat things happening. Now, obviously, the next question, and I'll tell you why that's important, because you are in the home of experiential reality. Orlando, Orange County is the number one hub of the world for virtual and augmented reality. So who's working on my virtual reality project? All right. So all you brilliant kids have a standing invitation to come here and work here someday. But I got to tell you, we've got a lot of virtual reality work. You're going to see it eventually in our playgrounds. This is something we're working on that I'm working on right now at Mayor Demings in the county. It's going to be in all the schools here and all the training we do in all our hospitals. We already have some of that already. So we want to make sure that you come back, all of you superstars, all you experts, especially in that virtual space, OK? Come on back and come work for us and come, come do some great work here, OK? Well, listen, have fun. Be the amazing, brilliant students you are. Enjoy Orange County. And thank you again for getting here. And thank you to your mentors and your coaches for getting here and showing us how exciting the future is of our generation to be working on STEAM. We're really proud of you all, OK? Have a fun time. Thank you. All right. I guess you all want to have your competitions to be on time, on schedule, and everything running right. So at this time, with one last round of applause, 
Our international problem captains are now going to have to go to their sites to prepare for you all. So let's thank them in advance. At this time, I would like to introduce my daughter. I don't like that phrase, I would like to. I'm going to introduce my daughter, Katerina Miklas, to tell you some of the activities that are available here while you're over the two days. Katerina. Thank you. <laughs> All right, good morning, everyone. <laughs> How are you this morning? I think you guys can be louder than that. We're back in person for World Finals. How are you this morning? <laughs> That's more like it. All right, so I'm Katerina Miklas, and I'm here to tell you about all the fun things to do within these next two days. So first, I think the thing we've missed the most, who's excited for some socially distanced pin trading? <laughs> All right, be sure to check out our pin trading right next door in WB3. Next, of course, you can't leave here without some World Finals swag, so be sure to check out our souvenir sales down at West Building Level 1. <laughs> and of course, we're so fortunate to have Dr. Sam here this year. So come on down at 2 p.m. today and tomorrow to West Hall Concourse for his book signing. <laughs> and we've got tons of cool backdrops located all throughout, so be sure to take some nice photo ops and you can hashtag them out of selfie. And thank you to our sponsors, Arm & Hammer. They've brought a giant baking soda box. It's super cool. So be sure to check it out with the pin trading in WB3 next door. <laughs> and over there as well, we will also have the Renatra Fusca replica, so you can go see that big, giant, water spider-looking thing. Super cool, super fun. Go take your picture with it. And then tonight at 7 p.m., we will have graduation. So come join me back here in this room, WB4, to celebrate all of our graduates this year. <laughs> we will also be hosting our coaches competition tonight. You can come on in and sign up right on the spot. Who's excited for that? <laughs> All right, so that'll be located right next door at WB3 at 8 p.m. tonight. And also next door at WB3, we will have Omer's pin collection. So be sure to check out all the cool pins from many decades now. And you can probably see Omer over there too. Get a picture with him too. Very cool stuff. <laughs> And finally, if you haven't done so already, we have an Odyssey Tournaments app. So if you see a QR code anywhere, be sure to scan it. It's our program guide for this year. We went digital. So you can find out where all the cool tournaments are, where everything else is. And most importantly, have fun these next few days. Meet new friends, trade some pins. Have a great time and good luck to everyone. All right, now to greet you and meet you and thank you properly, I introduce to you the man who made this all possible well over 40 years ago, Odyssey the Mind founder and my father, Dr. Sam. No, not yet. Thank you, Sam. Let me congratulate every one of you. For, uh, for sticking this year out. It's been my, my pleasure to, uh, to witness the 
enthusiasm and uh, what, every, everything that you're, you're trying to, to, you're doing here. Uh, I can feel the enthusiasm uh, emanating from, from you. I'd like to take just a, a few seconds and recognize another person, my wife, Carol. She, she was the uh, executive director of this organization for over 30 years. And it just so happens that this is going to be our 63rd wedding anniversary in a couple of weeks. Some of you, some of you may be so, uh, solving the problems of Odyssey of the Mind for the first time. Some of you have been in the program for a number of years, and sadly, some of you will be here for the last time. No matter which group you're in, always remember to take the skills that got you here uh, and, and being in the program, even if you didn't get here, uh, th these are lifelong skills that you're building. And uh, I wish all of you the best of luck. Thank you. Okay, so I'd like to ask you all to stand, please. All right, we're all gonna say the Odyssey Pledge together. So repeat after me. Odyssey of the mind is in the air. In our hearts and everywhere. My team and I will reach together to find solutions now and forever. We are the Odyssey of the Mind. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, let the games begin.